Hello, welcome to another Agisoft Metashape professional tutorial. In this tutorial, I want to go over some of the, the display settings that I, I use and recommend. So uh, first of all, we'll get this nice black background color configured for you. So if you go to Tools, go all the way to the bottom, you'll find Preferences. Now, uh, we'll kind of start from the top. So English is, is the preferred language. Uh, default view is the model view. Um, you can change this to dense cloud, uh, it depends on your preference there, but model is gonna, going to be the, the actual mesh model of, of your project or your site. Uh, and then theme is classic. Uh, I really do prefer this over the light or the dark theme, so I recommend this. Uh, it looks like it defaults to high uh, DPI mode, so we'll leave that, um, and then we'll leave the rest at defaults. Uh, if you're in a international foot state, be very careful to get this right. Uh, I'm in a U.S. foot state, so so I have this. My understanding is the, the U.S. foot for future NGS projections is on its way out. Uh, so definitely if you're watching this in the future 2022, um, pay close attention to that. Uh, the next tab, GPU, you do want to enable this. I, I don't see a reason why you would want this uh, disabled, but I believe it is disabled from, um, from the software by default. So go ahead and enable the, the uh, GPU processing. Now here's a network processing tab. Uh, you can do a, a local network processing. This is something that you would configure. Or if you look at another video that I've published, it's uh, it's a cloud processing video. And in that, I, I tell you guys how to set this up. Um, I recommend turning this on and, and definitely it's an option for you guys if you wanna try that. And appearance, uh, here's a couple uh, uh, options that you guys might like. And now background color, I change this to black. Uh, it defaults to kind of a gray. I have found on sites, you know, where you're doing some potential uh, data collection on sites where there's a lot of gray sand. It's not a lot of definition, but I have found black works very good. And then on this label color, I'm gonna change that to a white and then go ahead and apply that. Now, this will provide a lot of contrast, even against the model. So um, this is what I recommend. And then if you go to navigation, uh, you might have kind of uh, some preferences here. I don't, and then advanced, again, you might have some tweaks or some preferences here. I don't, uh, but if you guys think of something that, that could be uh, changed and, and there would be an advantage to doing that, please leave that in the comments below. I'd like to hear from you guys and, and definitely uh, uh, like to know if you have any settings uh, or preferences here that, that I haven't gone through. So uh, that's that. And uh, next I'm gonna go over in a, in a subsequent video the toolbars. So again, please like this video, subscribe to my channel. Thanks a lot for watching.